Two NC State University students are working to bring more Narcan to campus. They say right now it's hard to get and it could have deadly consequences. CBS 17's Dina Harley joins us live now from campus. And Dina, you spoke with one of those students today. Yeah, she told me that the GoFundMe has actually started a larger conversation about drug use on campus, drug culture, and why bringing these resources here to NC State and to Raleigh in general are really important. Nayla Din and her friend Alyssa Price started that GoFundMe. They're trying to get money to get more Narcan here on NC State's campus. They're both sophomores and both have personal connections as to why this is so important to them. Alyssa had a friend who overdosed last year, and Nayla says she's worked to get more resources to students for months now. While the university does offer Narcan already, the two students say they're there are obstacles to getting it, and so they're modeling their efforts on what they've seen from other campuses that have it more readily available. I also just see around all the different college campuses that um, Narcan is more accessible. So I know App State, they give out free Narcan for their students. UNC um, Chapel Hill, they give out free Narcan for their students. So I want to expand to multiple college campuses, and I want to bring this to NC State, where we're able to get all of students able to get that free Narcan if they want one. Right now, their goal for that GoFundMe is $7,500, but Nayla told me earlier that they're going to keep that GoFundMe open until probably the end of the semester. We'll have a link on our website if you're interested in getting involved. At NC State University, Dina Harley, CBS 17 News. All right, Dina, thank you.